Petronia Puswan has been there all day. So Petronia is uh, party in full swing yet? It is definitely in full swing. It's close to 9 o'clock and thousands of people are out here. It's like New Year's Eve out here in downtown Summerlin. A lot of people are here celebrating. Governor Brian Sandoval was even up here. It's really a cool environment, guys. Once the votes and ballots started rolling in from, excuse me. I'm the Excuse me, madam. Don't bring liquor here. You can just come and be by the water. Right. You can take a boat. If you could stop waiting for a second. Also happens to be a newspaper reporter, and he was here tonight. The biggest day today of the entire 10 days of worldwide. You're asked to call the East Metro Auto Theft, <laughs> Auto Theft Team. What other artists are going to be joining Bruno Mars during the halftime show? So I'm excited to hear about that. Um, make his first appearance. But in this case, uh, LaBeouf did not have that. Good morning, John and Randy. I can tell you that I just learned that about 35 people. It's hitting up against the seawall, and also we're worried about that tidal flooding in other areas. Tonight, some of Mizapata's very friends were at the EMP looking toward the future. Students stunned to learn what this federal complaint... <laughs> oh, my goodness. Uh, firefighters say that the... Uh, You're the on private property. Fuck. We have not gotten into the worst part of this storm yet. That is to come a little bit later on tonight. So, uh... Kim asked her and her supporters to say a prayer for Gina Roberson, who remains hospitalized for a stress-related illness. Car break-ins are down 28% this year, but he is urging people to keep their doors locked and to continue to communicate. You know, a lot of these commuters having to deal with losing their home right, or their car. He was and then, from the excuse subway. us for a second, I'm we're having some interference. Jim, I got to send it back to you in the studio. Every time we turn the camera on, we've just got a lot of idiots getting in our way. Live in West so Hollywood. Whoa! I'm sorry. Christina Tice, KTK, TLA 5 News. Back to you guys. Police tell us they are still looking for those eight suspects. Reporting live in southwest Atlanta, Anjali Proctor. Let's remember that, of course, he played under Roberto Martinez at Wigan. And at the time, he was very much uh, praiseworthy. Now, another advantage of this ID system is that the lines are very, very short. Are very, the lines are very, very short. And, um, wait. Okay, this pub, I've only seen a couple of people leave here in the last hour, and that's because they were going to get Bunny's tattoos on their arms, premiership tattoos. So, look, as you can see. Uh, ambulance just left, a fire truck just left. And there's a firefighter here right now, uh, but uh, everyone is out safe. We're live now tonight. Yeah. Well, I will show you, bitch. It's out here for many reasons, and it's just that's just one of the reasons. Yeah, put that on the news. Lausch bleibt, wie er im Moment ist und vor allen Dingen, dass er weiterhin aus südwestlichen Richtungen weht. Denn dann kann der F-Strom, der jetzt inzwischen eingesetzt hat, ungehindert in die Nordsee abfließen. Uh, but something that you cannot prepare for, something that is so horrific, it's affected so many people from those Oakland parents uh, up to the strangers who felt compelled tonight in Walnut Creek to come together for the vigil. We'll hopefully get confirmation either way in the next hour or so. Business still not completed here. Chris Hewton, the manager, still here on site at Carroll Road. Parent company of Lehman Brothers filing for bankruptcy as the subsidiaries basically wind down or Lehman tries to sell them off. In addition, huge, huge news. Still Please fun to watch. just stopped because of your reporting. Thank you so much for ruining the fun. Total, complete killjoy. All right, Something well. that's gone on for a decade and you've ruined it. Okay, okay. Uh, well, 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 well. In, inside their home, you heard from the mayor who said a number of people haven't left. That worries them, but at this point, if you haven't left, don't go out. You probably can't get out of Atlantic City anyway because the roads have become overwatched. We have to eat these really fast because they're not going to stay frozen. And she didn't believe me. She said, no, it's cold. I said, it has to be zero or ice cream won't stay cold. And lo and behold, it's so warm. Uh, VDOT is asking folks to uh, stay off the roads, and, uh, and, and that helps them move along quicker here. But if you can take a look at the road here. Uh, obviously, the buffoonery has returned. Oh, Coach Larry Drew said that adding Ramon sessions here midway through the season, he said that could have come with some challenges, but he feels like it's been a smooth one, and he said that the two players really complement each other well, and that's been the big reason for their success. And if you plan on coming down tomorrow, you can expect an even larger crowd.
crowd. It's supposed to be the busiest night for Fan Fest tomorrow. Oh, yeah. And, of course, lots of people drinking down here. Can you tell? Huge array of talent are going to be on stage. The likes of Stevie Wonder, Elton John, Robbie Williams. And then, of course, there's the man who's been the driving force behind it all, Gary Barlow. And earlier, my colleague Emily Maitley spoke to him. Drive half the speed limit that you would if you are out on the road, if you have to be on the road. Uh, but, yeah, I mean, cars parked in the middle of the road. We're seeing it right here all over. And um, just, you know, dodge that, dodge those cars in the road. Absolutely. Opening week when we hear you. Yeah. Please, who you got? Georgia. Who you got? Who you got? Who you got? <laughs> who you got? Well, I'm believing in number five, too, the fifth-year senior, Todd Boyd. Oh. I think with this crowd, one of the best atmospheres in college football. Just had a brief lull, one of the first in a long time. But now the wind's kicking back up again. Uh, Chad Myers, the meteorologist, CNN. He, he had said that, um, oh, there we go. Got some of the uh, some of the hooligans having some fun out there. There it is. So long we will come. Poly logi parko, no hienas. O thanas is exit na ute pro ke denak sipni si. Oh, oh. Yeah. ki mode me tapapusia. Oi. 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 When it's very gray. Thank you very much. <laughs> Esse equipamento causou um curto circuito um transformador e o próprio sistema daí desligou esses circuitos para que a falha não, não se estendesse ainda mais. Ainda há risco de ter mais algum apagão aqui em Pouso Alegre, na nossa região? Não, o nosso produto ele é exposto. Today he was back as a representative of the Razor. Yeah! telling us that the victim likely will be paralyzed for the rest of his life. He's the sole support of his family. 954-493-TIPS if you have any information. In Lauder Hill, I'm Hank Tester, NBC6, South Florida. Fremont Street here is the place where locals and tourists alike gather to listen to music. And, you know, people like this, they, they listen to this stuff all the time, for example. Do you see this guy's... Yeah, yeah, you like Michael Jackson too, don't you? Well, as you see, this guy's a little out of control right now, but you can't blame him for that. You know, let's tell you a little bit more about Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson. So, basically, the deal... Hi, how are you? If it... Um, are you having a good Friday today? Yeah, but uh, we're actually on the air. We're on TV. Yeah, thanks. Right now? Yeah, but, uh, thank you. What? Thanks for what? <laughs> What? You know, it just doesn't get any better than doing this stuff down here at Fox. <laughs> this is it? live TV, Ed. You're rolling with the punch as well. <laughs> Anyhow, for the past four months, I've been waiting for the Chrysler Concord to come in. Oh, 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 He's pulling his tail. That's the you Easter know. Bunny. You just can't get this type of entertainment on so many networks. <laughs> I called my friend Bajan Fatty out of Village Chrysler for many, many times back in December because I've been actually waiting on this car. And you're going to see Concords all over the road. Troy talked about how the zombies out here because they basically what is left is the people walking around with this glazed look in their eyes and just stumbling. Hey. Like this Love one behind me. Hi, yes. How are you doing? California. Oh, very nice to meet you. You know, we're going to do a story. You're going to do an interview with us? Sure. Okay, because we were just talking about here along Bourbon Street and uh -huh. the STD rate that's been going on here. And so how long have you, um, have you had an STD? I don't have an STD. Oh, then why did you want to talk? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my gosh. I'm so sorry. Are you serious? Something to be ashamed of. Right now. No, I don't have the STD. That's oh, not okay. Okay. Oh yes. Yeah. Anyway, so I've been taking care of the, yeah, that in my own little way. 49ers. <laughs> so, you can see what I've been having to deal with. <laughs> 